Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We thank God for today. We thank God for this new week. Glory be to God. Happy Monday. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. Wherever you're watching from, the Lord bless you and cause face to shine upon you in Jesus' name. Amen. This is another week. It's a glorious week. It's a wonderful week. We shall be blessed all throughout this week in Jesus' name. Amen. This is every word of God for daily living. Let's pray. Our precious Father, King of glory, Lord of Lord, I bless you, Lord. I give you glory, King of glory. Be thou exalted, be thou magnified, not like unto you, Lord. It's a, it's a privilege, oh God, to call you our Father, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father, for shining your light upon us, oh God, and causing us to understand your ways, oh God, to understand your word, oh God. And you gave us the knowledge, oh God, of your Son, Jesus. Oh Lord, how you went to the cross of Calvary and died for us, oh Lord. How you so much love us and you gave us your only begotten Son, oh Lord that whosoever believed in him oh, would not perish but have everlasting life thank you Lord Jesus for giving us everlasting life through your holiness and righteousness and believing in the name of your son be thou exalted oh God thank you Father for our life oh God I worship you Lord you are so good you are faithful oh God you are good and your mercy is forever hallelujah Lord, you are good, and your mercy is forever. Hallelujah. Jesus, you are good, and your mercy is forever. Hallelujah. You are good, and your mercy Hallelujah. Oh Lord, you are good and your mercy is forevermore. Hallelujah. Lord, you are good and your mercy is forever. Hallelujah. faithfulness to us of God morning by morning your mercies we see we have seen another new week again Lord it's by your mercy Lord oh day by day we come here oh God it's by your mercy oh God we sleep with assurance of waking up oh God it's by your mercy oh God many sleep slept last night oh God and they didn't wake up again Lord but your mercy is still upon us oh God be exalted be exalted 
exalted, be exalted. I worship you. I bless you, Lord. Be glorified. Be magnified. Great is your faithfulness to us also, Lord. Oh, forever, oh Lord. Not like unto you, Lord. Be exalted, Father. In Jesus' name, amen. Lord, we are here to receive another word from you. Oh Lord, come with your power, oh Lord. Come to speak. Come to heal. Come to deliver. Come to set free. Oh Lord, give understanding to hearts and minds, oh God. Let minds conform to your will. Let the eye, the skill in the eyes be fallen, be broken of the eyes of the people, oh God. Let understanding come, oh God. Let men be saved by your word. In the name of Jesus, draw souls to yourself. Even through this day devotion, oh Lord, draw souls to yourself. Let souls be healed and saved and delivered. For that is the purpose of your coming. That is the purpose of me coming here every day. That souls may be saved. That souls may turn to repentance. Ma, that souls may turn to Jesus. Father, oh Lord, let your perfect will be done. Oh God, I pray. Be exalted, Father. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Hallelujah. We give God the glory, honor, and adoration. In Jesus' name. Amen. Our topic today is Evangelism, the heartbeat of God. This is by Pastor Parika, the International Director of the Holiness Revival Movement Worldwide, short from Horemo. Today is Monday, February 7th, 2022. Our text is taken from the book of Matthew, chapter 28, verse 19 to 20. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost, teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. And lo, I am with you always, even unto the end of the word. Um, Key verse is taken from the book of Daniel chapter 12 verse 3. And they that be wise shall shine as the brightness of the firmament, and they that turn many into righteousness as the stars forever and ever. Amen. God give us great wisdom to win souls in this end time in the name of Jesus, that we will be like the stars that shine brighter and brighter in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. I take our reading. So winning is of utmost importance to God. After the fall of man at the garden of through Adam and Eve, he looked at the whole world and it repented him that he had created man. This taken from the book of Genesis chapter 6 verse 6. So he sought for what to do to redeem man and saved him from the from the dungeon of sin where he is perishing. So he sent his son Jesus to save man from the predicament. John 3 16. Oh yes we all know that scripture. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Hallelujah. Amen. So Jesus Christ gave his life to save man and reconcile man back to himself. Therefore, he saved us to save others. Amen. I say that again. He saved us to save others. Jesus saved us to save others. He didn't save us ourselves alone. He saved us to save others. Remember, he died to redeem us to himself and we, he, we are saved to save others, to go and preach the gospel, to go and preach the Lord, our Father God, the love of God to people. For Jesus came and preached this same love. For God so loved the world and he gave his only begotten son. For God so loved you and he died for you. Now you also, you believe him and you have come to salvation. You also go and say, oh sister, for God so loved you because it's that same love you have received and your life is full of the love of God and the hand of God and you are blessed and you are happy that when the Lord come, hallelujah, as you continue to live in the righteousness and the holiness of God, you will make heaven. Now you also take the same message, this same gospel that Jesus has given unto us that yes, our father love us. Sister, love the Lord. Give your life to God for God so loved you and he died for you. 
Hallelujah. Salvation is not just for you alone. God wants all men to be reconciled back to himself. God created man for himself, not for the devil, not to go to hell. But the enemy is doing so much in this end time that God requires you to stand up in any area. Oh, as you're going to walk on the social media, as I'm doing here by the grace of God. Oh, as, uh, maybe on Facebook, maybe on YouTube, or oh, anywhere. You go out there standing, using your trumpet to shout that Jesus loves you. Oh, come to righteousness. Come to holiness. Oh, repent from your sin. Oh, danger is coming. Hell is coming. Oh, give your life to God. For God so loved you and he wants you to himself. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. As you have known God, preach. Preach his holiness. Preach his righteousness. For you are saved to save others. He saved us and therefore commissioned us to preach out to others, to preach the word of God. Don't be saved alone and then hide it. Don't be saved alone and then be ashamed. If you are ashamed of Jesus, Jesus will be ashamed of you on that day. Don't be ashamed to preach the true word of God. Don't be ashamed to preach. Hallelujah. Proverbs 11 verse 30 says, The fruit of righteousness is the tree of life. And he that winneth so is wise. My brother, be wise. My sister, be wise. You see this person that is heading to hellfire? Speak to them. They may not know. They may have never heard. It may be ignorance on their part. But as you speak to them, the power of salvation that is in you will transfer to them and the Lord will do his work. Hallelujah. Not you, but God doing his work through you. You being a vessel in his hands. Hallelujah. Be that vessel. Say, Lord, I will be that vessel. Oh, God, I will be that vessel. Use me as a vessel of honor, oh, God. To push souls to you. To bring souls out of the kingdom of darkness into your marvelous life. I'm available, oh God. Use me, oh God. Say that and the Lord will use you. In Jesus' name, amen. This is the most essential part of our service to God. His heart beats and his heart pain. He desires that we bring others into this fold of holiness, of righteousness, of salvation. Before Jesus ascended into heaven, he commissioned the disciples and the believers to go into the world and preach the gospel. Go to the world and preach the gospel to all men. Everyone you see. No segregation, no no, nothing, whether it's Muslim or Hindu or whatsoever they believe in. Go with all boldness and preach the word of God. Hallelujah. Luke chapter 19 verse 10. For the son of man is come to to seek and to save that which was lost. To those who don't know God, they are lost. To those who don't call on the name of God, they are lost. To those who don't have the holiness and righteousness in their life, they are lost. To be lost is to be in the way of hell. To be lost is, 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 is a dangerous state. To be lost is, is, is to be in the way of hellfire. To be lost is to die and go to hell. If you so love the world as Jesus so loved the world, you will have the same body that Jesus has to go out to preach. To go out to preach the word of salvation to mankind. Hallelujah. Matthew chapter 28 verse 18 to 20. And Jesus came and spake unto them saying, All power is given unto me in heaven and in earth. Go ye therefore and teach all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, in the name of the Holy Ghost. This is an instruction for our Lord Jesus. Baptizing them in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. And lo, I am with you always. When you go out in faith, you will see the work of God. You will see the hand of God. You will see the power of God be manifested in you. When you go out knowing that the Lord is with you, you will not be afraid. Whether they're putting gun on your head, whether you are in a pit, whether anything happened on the way, my brother, you will not be afraid because you know that God is with you. He say, I am, not I will, I am anywhere at any time even here i am right now god i am is here i am with you always every time every second every time i am with you even unto the end of the world whether you're on the inside the cave whether you're on the mountain or in the valley inside the water god is with you 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hey, Sakataya. This is the boldness we have because God is with us. The above verses of the book of Matthew help us to understand what God wants us to do. This is why Jesus said that we must walk. We must walk. Why it is here called today? We must walk. Or tomorrow the Lord may come. And then it's too late. Tomorrow the, 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 the Bible said that the, 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 the fruit is ripe. But there's no labor. I said pray to the Father that God will send the laborers. Why not arise today and be that laborer? I'm talking to myself. Oh God give us the grace. To arise, oh God, in so winning, to be passionate for you, Lord, to go out there, oh God, oh, not just in our closet, Father, to go out there to speak boldly, oh God, that souls may be saved, that souls may come to righteousness, that souls may come to holiness. I pray for your grace, oh God, on my life, on your people, Lord, oh Father, help us, oh God, to arise for this greater work this year. In Jesus' name, amen. This is why Jesus says that we must walk to win soul while it is today. For nine's comments, when no man can walk, halakosa. Nine's comment, when no man can walk, he also left us. Hey, nine's comment, when no man can walk, for after the master has risen up. I shut the door and you stand behind knocking and say, Father, Father, oh, Master, Master, open the door. He will say, I know ye whence you are. I know ye not. Oh, may we not be that that is knocking after the door is shut. In the name of Jesus, my ego satire, I pray the Father that you will help us to arise and walk. Why is the car today? He who sire oh lord i pray the lord help me help me help us oh god to go out there to win souls help us oh god let the spirit of boldness sound man fearlessness oh lord strength in the law boldness in the law come upon us oh god come upon your people oh god to go out there oh god to preach your word fearlessly oh god boldly oh lord declaring the coming of god in the name of Jesus. No mind in the situation. No mind in what men can do unto you. But going out there to preach the salvation. The coming of God before it's too late. Oh, before night cometh. Where no man can walk. Oh, God have mercy. He also left us with a Holy Spirit. To help us fulfill this mandate. At chapter 1. Verses 8 says, But ye shall receive power after that the Holy Ghost is come upon you. And ye shall be witnesses unto me both in Jerusalem and in all Judea and in Samaria and unto the uttermost part of the earth. Hallelujah. 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 May the Lord give you the Holy Spirit. May you feel the power. May you receive the power of the Holy Ghost. May you walk in the might of God. May the power of the Holy Ghost come upon you for exploit. To go out. To preach the word of God. To go out. To our nations. To our streets. To our corner. May the power of God rest upon you for great service. For great work. Oh, in the holiness and in the righteousness of God. That after you walk, you also can receive the crown. Hey, in the name of Jesus, that after you walk, you too will not be a castaway. In the name of Jesus, may the Lord endow you and empower you with the spirit of boldness, the spirit of the Holy Ghost. Oh, to do great service for him. In the name of Jesus, amen. Hallelujah. There are many people languishing in sin. Arise, child of God and be committed to the ministry of reconciliation because you cannot afford to meet Jesus empty handed oh lord I cannot afford to meet Jesus oh must I go and empty handed must I meet my savior so not one soul in which to greet him must I empty Must I go and empty handed? Must 
Cause I need my savior so No I want so And wish to get him Must I have that go Say Lord I will not empty hand I will not enter heaven empty hand Oh Lord I will not enter heaven empty hand Oh God give me the grace oh God To win souls for you Lord Let this platform win souls oh God This platform of daily devotion uh, Win souls oh God In the name of Jesus This work will not be fruitless Oh Lord cause it to be fruitful In the name of Jesus I will not greet you on empty handed I will not greet you on empty handed My work will not born of God in the name of Jesus when I get to heaven people will say sister I had you in the internet and I gave my life to God in the name of Jesus so begin to pray for yourself say Lord give me the grace I will not greet you empty handed I will not come to heaven empty handed oh Lord let souls be one through me use me as a vessel I summon myself as a vessel in your hand to you oh Lord use me oh Lord give me wisdom to win souls give me the grace Give me the strategy, give me the tactics Help me, oh God, to win soul To win soul, oh, to let my flesh go That your spirit may come in And use me as a vessel A honorable vessel In your hands, oh God In the name of Jesus I surrender, we surrender to you, Lord Use me, oh God Use us, oh God I am, oh, sire Use us, oh God Oh Lord, use us, oh God. We surrender. I surrender, Jesus. I surrender, Holy Ghost. Begin to tell Jesus, I surrender. Use us, oh God. Use us in your hands. Use me. Use us as a vessel in your hands. Use me, Lord. Use me oh God I want to greet you that day when I see you I will shout hallelujah and the souls that was watching me by your message will come and we will dance with the Lord we will be with the Lord forever we will greet Jesus with our gifts with our souls the souls that has won oh they have they shall be the gifts who we'll give so greet Jesus just like the three wise men came and greet Jesus with gifts those fancy cranky says our man our souls shall be the gift we we'll give to Jesus. Oh, when well, we we'll meet him in heaven. Oh, Lord, my God. Help me, Lord, to have enough gifts to greet you, Lord. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, amen. Hallelujah. Oh, Lord, we thank you, Father, for greater things you are doing in our life in this season. I hallow you, Lord. I bless you, Lord. Thank you, God, for the great and the way that works, you will do through us this year. Oh, be exalted, Father. In Jesus' name I pray. Hallelujah. Amen. We thank God for today. Our third for the day says, There is much joy in heaven over one sinner that repents. Much joy. The heavens rejoice. The angels sing hallelujah over one soul that repents. Don't say just because that one soul is tangible. It's great. Great in the sight of God. Oh, may we have thousands, even millions of souls. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Remember our scripture? I think it's in our text. It says that those that brought many to righteousness, their stars will shine brighter and brighter. It said, teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. What I want to read. Okay, so I have key verse. He say, and they that be wise shall shine. They that be wise. I mean, those, for the Bible said, those, he that winneth the soul is wise. He said, they that be wise shall shine as the brightness of the firmament. And they that turn many to righteousness as the stars forever and ever. Hey, hallelujah. May we be like the stars forever and ever and ever and ever in eternity. In glory, in Jesus' name, Amen. It's an exciting thing to work for God. God is the uh, the only boss that cannot cheat you. The only boss that pays you and rewards you with much more glory. Hallelujah! Than you are even worked for, Amen. Thank you, Father, for today the devotional. We bless you, Lord. We give you glory, Oh Lord. As we go 
but through this week we shall be blessed. We pray, Lord, that you will give us souls every day. That at the end of the week we'll have seven souls, oh God, to greet you. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Oh, blessed be your name. Thank you for wisdom to win souls. I bless you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. We thank God for today. Hallelujah. 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 Have a glorious week. Have a glorious day. The Lord bless you and God's face to shine upon you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.